Our NMN NAD, and NAD in particular, how do we view this? Is it a pathway that we should be focusing on in terms of supplementation or infusions for sake of extending our life? My answer on that is no. Yeah, I would say the same. You know, I, I don't remember who said this, but someone, maybe it was Nassim Taleb said, don't tell me what you think, show me what's in your portfolio. Like, meaning people who pontificate about this stock versus that stock, he's kind of like, assuming it was him that said this, he's like, okay, I, I don't care what you're telling me, tell me what you own. That's gonna show me your conviction. So through that lens, look, I'll show you my conviction on exercise, I'll show you what I do, I'll show you my conviction on sleep, this is what I do, I'll show you my conviction on all these other things. I mean, I don't take these supplements, full stop. I don't take them because I can't afford, it's not that I can't afford them, it's not that there are any inconvenience to me to take them. I, passionately do not believe they do anything for me and why would i waste time money anything on something that i really don't believe makes a difference now again i am always happy to be proven wrong and i am very happy to say that two years from now five years from now we could be doing this exercise again and in the presence of new information maybe i'm not taking rapamycin and maybe i am fistfulling you know nr and nmn possible i will i will reserve the right to change my mind for the rest of my life in the presence of new data. But as it stands today, I do not take these supplements and I have no foreseeable plan to do so until information changes. Great. Thank you for that clear stance and the willingness to change it in light of new data.